My name is Benson Kande, a young water professional in Sierra Leone, and I have a BSc in Natural Resources Management from Jala University, Jala Makonde. And I also have a diploma in water supply from Bolivia, Imas International. I grew up in the rural community where I had to walk a long distance with my family, younger sister, to fetch water. And as a result of that, there was a time my younger sister went to the stream to fetch water and she lost her life. It took us three days for us to notice that she got drowned in the well. So based on that problem, children walking a long distance to fetch water, fetching water from unprotected well, I decided to work on a pump design where in children don't have to walk a long distance from the community to fetch water and also see how we can improve an open hand dog well instead of using a traditional method of fetching water which is not protected and which is not safe. I was a runner-up for the National Youth Innovation Award 2019 organized by UNDP and uh, as a result of uh, my presentation, my innovation got an attention where the UNDP Association Lab decided to run a test and, uh, on my pump and my in beef filtration system to see how safe it is for the health of the people and for those, the end users who will be using the pump, whether it is safe for their health or not. As a result of that, I was contracted by the UNDP country office to do 10 boreholes and install my pump design in 10 slum communities. And not only that, uh, I was able to increase on my staff in non power we are in. We have over 15 technicians, 8 staff and the others are volunteers and we have over 4 females presently. Based on also this engagement, uh, we are also thinking of organizing a big training we are in. We give out drilling equipment where technicians pay money at the end of every month to the company as a means of creating revenue for the company as well and this is also a big impact to the company because this is something we have been thinking about and uh, we, we only accomplish it based on the engagement we got with the UNDP country office. Uh, the government and other agencies and organizations have done a lot of impact to see that access to safe drinking water is achieved in, in the world, Sierra Leone to be specific. And, uh, but one of the things is um, the community people cannot afford to do a borehole by themselves because of the cost involved. Neither an individual can provide, be able to sponsor himself or herself to do a borehole. So we also thought of um, working on a drilling system using a locally built equipment where you can use a little phone to drill your own borehole in your compound, in your community, so you can have access to safe drinking water without going for mechanical drilling or hydraulic drilling that costs too much. Before the establishment of the UNDP Accelerator Lab, we as innovators, we are doing our own little things in the corner. We are in, there was no mentorship, no advice, and no networking. The UNDP Accelerator Lab created a WhatsApp group with different innovators. And uh, the essence of the group is to see how we can know each other and how we can network. For example, if you have an innovator that is doing irrigation, and you have an innovator that is doing the pump system, how the one with the irrigation system can network with the one with the pump system to be able to implement a project or something big. So this is one thing that is really making a lot of impact and uh, the advice they are giving us as, as innovators also is helping us on how to modernize our design and want to do more improvement on our design so that the, 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 the people will see how important our design is, how important our innovation is to the country as well. So you see, Benson is just one of so many local innovators that we've mapped out and are contained in our Grassroots Solutions database. UNDP Accelerator Lab will continue to seek out and hunt innovators with high potential solutions that can be scaled.